Hello. Welcome to part four. We, well, uh, since the last part I caught some Pokemon, and now we're ready to head to Jubilee City. But of course, our fun walk is interrupted by your first ever trainer, trainer battle. And here we go. Youngster Tristan has a Starly. Now, if you haven't done any work on leveling up your Pokemon, uh, he will probably be quite a challenge. Now, I have leveled, I don't know if you can see it, but I have leveled the Chimchar up to level 8. And ye gods, it took a while. <laughs> now, this Starly is only difficult because it's the first Pokemon you'll fight that if you've kept your Pokemon at level 5, it'll be the first Pokemon you fought that is the same level. And, you know, it won't be anything puny like level 2 or 3 that you could easily beat before. So, you might want to level up your Pokemon first. Okay, next comes this lady who has two Pokemon, if I recall correctly. Yeah, she does. Alright. Oh, yeah, yeah. Two Bidoofs. Both at level three, if memory serves. Now, if you've got Chimchar, it learns Ember at level seven, which is an asset, alright. I mean... You're not going to want to go around flaunting your scratch for a long time. You're going to want to learn Ember, which can put Pokemon to sleep very quickly. And, no. Okay, I'm going to show you some of the new Pokemon I caught. Bye-bye, Scout. Okay, yes, his name is Carrie. I named him after Drew Carey, because Drew Carey is awesome. <laughs> That's not even sarcasm, Drew Carey is awesome. Now, Carey, the Shinx, only has Tackle and Leer at the present moment. However, he is, uh, much stronger than, uh, the Bidoof. He's, he's double, uh, the Bidoof's level, so, um... It shouldn't be long until he starts learning some moves. Some decent moves. And there we have it. That should have taken a shorter amount of time, but hey, what the hell, you know? And that was pretty darn good, in my opinion. And of course, the money you get for your victories... Okay, well, Pokemon didn't want that, but hey. Yeah, another Shinx. You can catch Shinxes on this route. They generally come at pretty low levels. <laughs> that goes really without saying, though. So if I edge my way quietly through the tall grass... Jesus! Oh, God almighty. A Bidoof. The reason I refrained from catching a Bidoof was because, you know, they suck. Okay. I'll show you my other new Pokemon as well. I caught a Starly. Okay, you might think, you know, Starly? Why? You know? The reason you'll want to catch a Starly is because it evolves into Staraptor. Which has close combat, which is the most awesome move ever. Well, in my opinion, I just love close combat. It's too much fun. Okay, Shinx, this is a... I don't... You've never fought one that belongs to another trainer. Okay. Now, usually this would be like... This would be stupid because Shinx is an electric type and... Um, Starly's a flying type, but... uh. Never fear, we have Quick Attack. 
And yes, my Starly is called Styles, named after Ryan Styles. From whose line is it anyway? A show that Drew Carey is also on. Honest to God, if I like something, all my Pokemon get uh, themed names. <laughs> Yeah, so yeah. And if you haven't watched Whose Lines It Anyway, you know, you really should. I think I put a link to it, uh, the main Whose Line channel in my last uh, part of this walkthrough. Oh, that's a lot of EXP. Yep. Yeah. I thought so. Level 7. And Youngster Logan is defeated. And before you think it's all over, you get it. I think at night time and in the morning time you can also find the Pokemon Cricket Top on this route, which, uh, you know, which evolves into Cricket Tune, and despite it having the most annoying cry out of any Pokemon ever, Disgust. Actually, maybe Jinx's is a bit worse, but yes. Despite it having the most annoying cry out of any Pokemon ever <laughs> discussed, you should uh, really, you should really think carefully about whether you want one because it's of absolutely no use whatsoever, and it's a really, really crappy Pokemon. And here is Jubilife City, where Dawn approaches you. Dawn, hi, are you catching Pokemon? Um, I think you feel a lot. Jesus Christ. Yeah, and so it tells about the trainer school. And that's where Ralph is, and so that's where you want to go. Okay, now she's gone. I'm gonna quietly save the game and go away. <laughs> okay, so that's it for part four. See you momentarily. Bye-bye.